Hello guys and welcome back to another Fallout 4 mod spotlight video and this time we're going to be taking a look at Ely's Armor Compendium also known as EAC or Ely's. I, I don't really know how to pronounce this person's name um, but it, it I think it's pronounced Eleonora. You guys probably heard this person before they're kind of famous in the modding space. Um, but yeah, this is an, uh, as you've heard in the title, it is an armor mod, or rather it adds a lot of different armors. According to the actual mod page, it adds plus, like 80 plus new armors, uh, 30 plus new accessories, and then a ton of colors for different things. So uh, yeah, you, you guys already kind of know what I'm going to be taking out, a lot of armors in this case. It also adds a brand new location to the game, which is called uh, Elise or Elise's Shop. It's right next to Mass Pike Tunnel East, in case you guys want to know where it is. And uh, this is me entering it for the first time ever. You can see the incredible kitties here. We have someone named Elijah. And then we have... Uh, there was another character. Yeah, here we go. That is uh, another character. And she's voiced. Hey Don't even bother with Becky's racks in DC. My stuff will make you look awesome and keep you safe at the same time. Hey, what about a what shop kind of then? Do you sell? Clothes I mashed up, combined, scavenged and made look amazing. I also have a schematic for a custom clothing workbench. And some notes about armor designs, if you're interested. And I specialize in vault suit modifications. Very cool, right? Let's see what and you have. And then, of course, yeah. you can buy all the armors we from. Really need um, to get you out of that. There's another mod. You can't just insult another mod. Anyway, uh, here you can buy a ton of the outfits. It's not all the outfits. Okay, you can't buy all the outfits. But a ton of the outfits, they should spawn natively in the world, by the way, in case you you kind of want more stuff to kind of just be around the place. Um, so they should spawn on raiders, on settlers, all throughout the world. So it should just be that. And it's also compatible with CBBE and, of course, uh, Body Slide, in case you have those things. And here there are a couple examples of some of the clothing. You can see that it's very high quality. Uh, a couple different things. A couple t-shirts. Uh, some new t-shirts, some hats and helmets and stuff. It's very cool. It adds a lot of different outfits. Some stuff that could look kind of cool. So you see, there's also another vault suit modification. Now I cannot show everything in this. Um, well, this is refreshing. In this mod. You look like an actual paying customer. I didn't change my clothes. You insulted it before. You also have normal-looking clothes that are kind of plain. Uh, wait, vault 101. Okay. Um, but yeah, uh, I'll be pausing the video for now and then I'll join you guys again when... Actually, no, I don't think that's necessary. But again, you, you can kind of see all the different armors. They even some added from the earlier games that uh, it's kind of just been added back again. Now, again, I, I can't show you all of the armors. I, I, I'm not really planning on deep diving into it. Really? They have this too? Oh, that's great. There's a Fallout New Vegas, I'm pretty sure. Maybe not that specific one, but something that looks like it. Uh, but yeah, hopefully you guys get the gist of what this is. You also get this schematic for this one called Ellie's uh, Armor Crafting Station. And here I'm betting when you have recipes, you can craft the different outfits. Um, but yeah, that's kind of all there is to it. It has this whole new location, a lot of new outfits to kind of just spawn nasally throughout the world. And in here you can also buy some clothes from it and take a look at some of it. Uh, so um, yeah, uh, but let's talk to this guy as well. Don't eye the Brahmin if you got any sense. Oh, because this is like a bodyguard kind of guy. Just native to the game, I suppose. Let's see um, but yeah, v v very well made, I'd say. Uh, fits in very well into the wasteland, so no need to worry about immersion breaking stuff or anything. And uh, yeah, it's just made very well. And it's also recently been updated as well here in 2024. So uh, if you guys are looking for a clothing mod, uh, this is definitely my go-to and one I would highly recommend. Uh, it, it just it just fits in the world so well and adds so many different things it even adds a lot of funny things that you should try out like you know vault bubble heads and and, and fun, funny outfits and stuff it is certainly something i recommend you try out so um yeah w without any more to say I, I i'm gonna leave the surprises for you guys you know what it is now you know how much it adds and all of them are quality okay it's not quantity over quality either it's every single outfit has quality um, and also quantity is like the best balance you can have as well. So um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed uh, this mod spotlight. If you did, consider liking, subscribing and sharing. If you want the mod yourself, it is in the description below. Uh, I have a link to it. And there you can read about it in case you want to know more about it as well. So um, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Hope to see you guys in another one of my mod spotlight videos. Or one of my let's plays. And as always, stay awesome.